Casper, I'm a project engineer here at Mac Water, and this is a uh, brackish water RO plant for potable water that we're setting up to a camp up in the Pilbara here in WA. So for this feed water we actually don't need a huge amount of salt rejection, so we've got a low pressure system as opposed to particularly high pressure for something like seawater. All the pipe plug wraps around the container, we've got all our instrumentation along here, and then that gets sent out to the uh, treated water tank. The feed pump equipment, pressurizing the system through the glass filtration. We have cartridge filtration and the uh, low rejection uh, reverse osmosis modules. The plant's got glass pre-filtration for the RO system. So we've got twin um, vertical glass filters with self-controlling uh, five-way backwashing valves. A few places here of large pumps for irrigation water. It gets sent out to, to water all the gardens and whatnot on the, uh, on the camp and then a triplex of pumps here for potable water for drinking. Uh, and so we've got the, the large potable water distribution pumps, two large accumulators, so the camp's gonna be housing around 500 people when it's full. So as you can imagine, there's quite a lot of, 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 uh, of water demand for that. In order to keep the kind of chemical system as safe as possible, we've got a um, IBC with the day tank set up for the chemicals. So as opposed to being inside the camp container with everything else, we've got the dosing pumps here set up. They've got a connection down there to a manifold into the day tank for the system. And then the client can just uh, replace the IBC periodically um, uh, to reduce the amount of chemical handling required. Distribution board to send power across to all the equipment in and outside the container. And then we've got the large Form 4 mine spec panel sitting at the back here with indication for every motor dry on the, on the plant, as well as a HMI for control of the system sitting up here. So on the plant we've got um, the premium instrumentation package throughout. So we've got engines and house, flow, pressure and analytical instrumentation um, across the board. So we've got field indication as well as feedback to the actual PLC panel for um, sending back to all the clients' SCADA system as well. As the plant's coming up to the Pilbara, we get quite a lot of warm weather, so the entire system's all insulated throughout. We've got a reverse cycle roof-mounted air conditioner here. Um, there's a lot of equipment, so we need to keep it all cool. 